What's up, Wesleyan student athletes, coaches, and trainers? I want to thank you all for all you've done this fall in competition, in the classroom, and in the community. Wesleyan student athletes and those who support them are models of hard work, passion, and drive. Look, everyone knows that I'm a music professor, and I was definitely not an NCAA athlete in college, so you might not think I have any connection to athletics at all, but I've played hockey since I was young. No, we're not starting a hockey team and we're not building an ice rink. I'm reminded every time that I come out and play hockey just what it means to be part of a team. It takes hard work, it takes dedication, it takes sacrifice, and a willingness to get better. It ain't easy, but it does mean you get incremental victories. As a college, we've taken that willingness to improve to heart this year. This fall, I sanctioned a special athletics commission that's made up of faculty, coaches, and staff, and is facilitated by a really qualified consultant with a vast array of athletic experiences. And that group is thoroughly examining every aspect of what we do in competition, because we owe it to all of you to understand how we can be better incremental victories. The goal of the study is to make sure that we're meeting the needs of our student athletes in every way that we can measure. So this February, the commission will report to me and the board of trustees, my bosses, on its findings and it's going to make firm recommendations to aid and improve the athletic department here at the college. Now, while it's too early to share the preliminary work, I'll tell you that the improvements to facilities, operating budgets, equipment, and policies are all going to be on the menu. Small steps now, Big returns soon, incremental victories. Now listen, these changes won't come overnight. Some will require big investments and might happen over a couple of years. But to make sure we're getting all this done, this week we announced a new project within our college's strategic plan to monitor and execute the findings of the commission and to ensure that the investments and improvements are gonna happen as quickly and as efficiently as possible with lots of aggressive timelines and reporting tied into it. This spring, I expect that some of these initial changes will become visible and tangible to all of you. Just like we've already started foundational changes to policies and budgets for the coming year in athletics. Incremental victories. Everybody at the college is excited to do this work with you as a team. I hope you all enjoy a well-deserved holiday break and I can't wait to see what you accomplish this spring. Now while we're not going to be building an ice rink or starting a hockey team anytime soon, much to my chagrin, I'm so pumped to build on the successes each of you make possible every single day and to continue the proud tradition of athletics at West Virginia Wesleyan College.